we're going to be looking at the use of image intensifiers for x-rays. Film is not very sensitive to x-rays. Most of the x-rays actually pass straight through. However, film is more sensitive to visible light. So image intensifiers are used and they're placed above and below the film so that they can increase the image contrast, however, not the clarity or detail of the image, so that the exposure time is reduced. Without the image intensifiers, you would need to have a very long exposure time to get a good quality image from the x-rays. The image intensifiers are coated with phosphor and the phosphor atoms absorb the x-ray photons. As a result, the atoms fluoresce emitting many visible light photons. So one x-ray photon can be converted into many visible light photons and that's because an x-ray photon has more energy because it's at a higher frequency than visible light. And as film is more sensitive to light than it is to x-rays, the many visible light photons produced from each x-ray photon will result in increased blackening of the film. So less x-rays are needed to get a good quality image so the exposure time is reduced. Also the metal back is needed to stop any x-rays that would pass straight through and out of the film cassette. So the metal back reflects the x-rays back onto the film and this will maximize exposure the blackening of the film